welcome to the Vladivar Mixology class. And uh, today, I, Amit Shoff, I'm going to try and teach you all some cocktails where we're going to demystify the whole complications of cocktail making and you're going to be able to make your own cocktails at home. So, we're going to start with the three flavors of uh, Vladivar. We have the regular Vladivar, a triple distilled vodka charcoal filter as well, a very smooth one. Uh, we have the citrus zest and we have the green apple zest. And these two flavors uh, have a dual flavoring uh, involved with them. So it's pretty interesting. The green apple has a combination of mint and green apple. And the Vladivar lemon zest has a combination of lemon and mint. So two dual flavors and uh, welcome. Okay, so now we're going to be making a cosmopolitan. We're all going to be using. You can use your regular standard uh, straight vodka. Oh, but I think the lemon zest will go really well with it. It will add the citrus flavor, you know, uh, to your Cosmo, which will be a nice touch to it. So start from here, and 1,000, 1,000, 2,000, 1,000. So now we're going to use 15 ml of coin through. Okay. So now when there's a pourer, we're just going to, now you're going to, we do it one by one since we have one bottle. So just count 1,000, 1,000, and stop. I'm The regular way, yeah? yeah. <laughs> okay, cool, go for it. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Nice, nice. Go for it, go for it. Just a little bit more. That's enough. That's enough. Yeah. Okay, I didn't expect it to. Okay, so you're gonna. Can I see stop, stop? Yeah. Thousand, one thousand. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> We've got about uh, 45 ml of larva lemon zest. We've got 15 ml of coin through or orange liqueur you can use. And then now we're gonna add about 10 ml of lemon juice and uh, 60 ml of cranberry juice. And then we're gonna shake it really well. Yeah? Oh. We're going to use a peg measure just so that it doesn't get too much. Because if you add more alcohol, it's okay. But you know, more lemon juice, it's like it can spoil the drink. So. And we're going to add 60 ml of cranberry juice. We're going to add lots of ice to all our glasses. So we'll come in this side. So fill it up with ice. That's good. Yeah. Now, if you put very less ice, you know, the what will happen is when you're shaking, it'll melt too fast, the ice. When you put a lot of ice, there's so much ice, there's so much more coldness that's happening that it won't melt as much. It's like that. So it's, yeah, that's good. So we fill it up. We take our shakers yeah, and we shut it, like place this glass down, giving it an angle like this, we shut it, yeah, then take that to the top, it's, it's shut, yeah, good, lift it up, take it back, like this, lift it up and take it back, yeah, no, take it all the way back to the shaker, yeah, it's correct, it's correct, take it all the way back, and now forward back, forward back, forward back. Yeah, I'm doing faster. Yellow. Okay, now take it back this way. Yeah. Bring your hand, put it down. Okay. And when you want to open the shaker, we give it a push sideways. Like that. Okay. And then. So front, back, front, back. Give it a hand. Uh, yeah, like that. Open it up. Okay. Is it supposed to be frothy? Uh, yeah, I mean, if you give it a vigorous shake, then it'll, it'll get hot. It's about giving it a good jerk. You know, it's giving it a good push. Uh, but this is fine. Your co your drink has shaken up well inside, so it doesn't. The frothiness will subside after a while. So just drop your glass in on top. Like this? Yeah. So this is if you don't have a hot on strainer. So try holding your shaker now like this, and one finger on top. Okay. We have small finger. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's good. Yeah, but like that. So you can even hold it together, okay. you know, giving it support from one end and like that. And now, one by one, we can just try and... So I'm supporting it with my left hand from the bottom. I'm holding the glass on the top and I'm slowly pouring it out like that. Okay. So all your ice is going to stay inside. Add a garnish on the top. Yeah. 
Business. So there you got your Cosmo.